What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm coming back to y'all with another tier list. One of my, like, my literal favorite movie. What is this? Saga? Like, is it a saga? Literally my favorite movie series franchise right now, bro. We're going to do a tier list for it. So I have to actually make this tier list, y'all. I actually have to go ahead and uh, make a tier list that had the Harry Potter movies. But also those three Fantastic Beast movies. Because we're gonna go just we're just gonna call this the Wizarding World Quiz. You feel me? So we have them in as S A B C D and F. So should we just go in order? So all right, so we're going in order. We're gonna start with the first movie. First movie, and we're strictly doing movie, y'all. No books. Like let's just we're pretending like these the books do not exist. Is that the movies is the only thing you know, and we're gonna start like that. You feel me? So doing it like that, the introduction into the Wizarding World. I want to call this an S tier. This is probably an S tier start off. I'm not gonna lie. Wait, okay, okay. Honestly, okay, I'll give it an A. Only because uh, see. I'll give it an A plus. It's I give it an A plus only because look, th hear me out, hear me out. I know y'all, I know y'all mad, but hear me out, bro. Prisoners is low key harder, bro. Prisoners is low key harder, bro. Like okay, we we I'm gonna give it an A, and then we gonna we just we just gonna have to leave it there. This is my list. This is my list. So we going with Chamber of Secrets next. I'm be honest, Chamber of Secrets is like a real. I want to call this a real C or B tier movie, bro. This is it's definitely not A or S. It's Loki drags. If if I'm calling this C, I'll give I'll give this a B. We'll we'll see how we feel when we get to another one, and where it will be. Okay, because we're gonna we're definitely putting is this prisoners right here. Prisoners is definitely S tier, S tier, bro, S tier, bro. I there's no way you're not telling me you don't like Prisoners, bro. That's probably the best movie of all, like, like, of the first four, like part one. Looking at, it's like the best, best movie, bro. And then we get to what was it? Goblet of Fire, y'all. Goblet of Fire. Where is that, bro? Is it this one? Here it is. I think it's this one. Goblet of Fire, bro. Like I said, we can't do it based off of books. So Goblet of Fire movie wise, I can give it a C tier. I can give it a C tier. Ooh, this is hard. Here, look, 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 look. We'll give it C tier. And let's just see, let's just see how we how we get through the rest of this. Order of the Phoenix. Order of Phoenix is definitely is definitely A tier, bro. I'm giving it A tier. It's it hit S moments only because literally the Dumbledore and Voldemort fight. And literally, we can't just base that the S tier just off of that moment, bro. That's one S tier moment in the whole real in the whole movie, really. Like, yeah, I'll give this an A. This is a strong A, bro. And that's really, and like, like I said, that's really that fight carrying a lot of that. That's really that fight. If not A, bro, B, bro. I think it's fine. I think it's fine at B, actually. I think it's fine at B because it's a great, it's good movie. But with that fight scene, I'm, it's making it so biased for me because that fight scene is literally wizarding at its best, bro. And how. Not just seeing beams just stupefy or a vodka cadaver of all the freaking time. It's real wizarding fights where that mess is not going to work against this guy, bro. You need to try anything in your power to do something, bro. And that's, oh my God, that fight is so good, bro. We lost James in there. Um, not James. We lost Sever. Uh, not Sever. Oh my God, bro. What's wrong with me? We lost, um, what's, bro? 
Serious Black. There we go. We lost Serious Black too. Oil alert. I I can leave that at B tier. I'm not mad at that being a B tier movie, y'all. Wait, is this Order of the Phoenix? What what is this? Is that what is that? Hold on, y'all. Am I tripping? Oh, that's Half Blood Prince. I'm tripping, y'all. What the hell? This is uh, yeah. There we go. Order of the Phoenix. So then, what else we got here? Oh, we could just zoom in just like this. This is nice right here, just like this too. All right. So, uh, after Order of the Phoenix, we have Half Blood Prince. Okay. Half Blood Prince. I'm gonna call it a C C tier movie, bro. This is this is a C tier movie. That's just for me, bro. It's it's all right. But okay, so that would mean I'm saying Half Blood Prince. Okay, okay. See, this is what I'm saying. So I can put half. Ooh, I could put Chamber of Secrets as a C tier movie. But then I would have to put one of these at B tier, bro. And if I'm really being honest, one I would choose to watch before any of these would probably be Half Blood Prince. Oof, that's a hard one, bro, because Goblet of Fire. Like, movie wise. Okay, I'll do it like this. <laughs> Because I'll watch Order of the Phoenix. Mm. Would I watch Order of the Phoenix before Chamber? I don't think I would, honestly, y'all. I don't think I'd watch Order of the Phoenix before Chamber. It'd have to be like this. I think that's good right there. Jesus, this is harder than I thought, bro. Way harder than I thought. All right, so this is the bias because this is like all the stories coming together. This is A tier content, bro. And then we're going to end it off with you already know S tier content, bro. Look, that's a strong movie. That's a strong movie series, bro. Because none of these are F tier content. If we're just talking straight movies, no books, y'all. No books on this list, y'all. The books do not exist. Just the movie. Pretend you was a kid that never seen the books and only seen these movies. This is a strong list. Having no F D and F tier movies, that's good. Now let's get into this Fantastic Beast. Okay, so Fantastic Beast are where to find them. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'll give this a strong B tier movie. I'm not gonna lie to you, straight, straight B tier, and I'm happy with that. Crimes of Grindelwald, it, Johnny Depp is what makes this movie. But like I said, it, if we're going off just movie stuff, we can't really bring book into this. So just movie and entertainment wise, I'll give this, uh, I'll, okay, I'll give this, this is what y'all gonna see. I'll give this low key a C, only because it was an entertaining movie. That that man Johnny was entertaining. That freaking fight scene with the uh blue dragon and all of that, beautiful, bro. Beautiful, bro. That's that almost pushes it to a B. But if I do that, actually, I could do that. I could do this. I could do that. I could definitely do this. I could definitely do that. Now, Secrets of Dumbledore is a D tier movie, y'all. It's for Dumbledore, y'all. That's straight D tier movie, bro. And that's just because it was so much. It was so much confusion that it did it, it wasn't, I don't know how to explain it. It was just so confusing, bro. 
And that ain't it. That ain't it. That ain't it, bro. But look at this. You can't tell me this is not a fire list, bro. This is a fire, bro. Look, hey, comment down below, bro. You can't tell me this. This ain't it right here. You can't tell me this ain't it. Comment down below, bro. Comment down below. All right, y'all, that's the tier list, y'all. That's the tier list right there, y'all. That's my Harry Potter, Fantastic Beasts, The Wizarding World tier list. Um, Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Ring that bell so you're notified when the next video posts. And I'll come back to y'all uh, next tier list, Disney, uh, a Disney tier list, or a um, Marvel tier list. They're both coming. We don't know which one's coming first. Love you guys. Peace out. You feel me?